Thank you, Brian. It's the mystery of a body on a beach. A dead whale floated ashore at Salmon Point on the Buren Peninsula. The question is, why? Scientists are trying to find out. Here's Martine Blue with the inside story. On this tranquil remote beach, there's no yellow tape but there is a body. An adult sperm whale was discovered dead here at Famine Beach. A team of investigators arrive on the scene. What we're going to do today is we're going to uh, go over and uh, measure up this animal, uh, take some samples from it, look for some obvious signs of, uh, of uh, trauma or, uh, or uh, net entanglements on it. The tide is too high to work on the whale. The team attempts to reel him in. Finally, the sea level retreats, allowing the experts to work on their cadaver. It's a big job. We got to, the stomachs on those are pretty big. Uh, you're looking at a, a capacity of probably 1,500 liters in the whole, in, in the three different stomachs that are in the animal. And this is pretty unusual because this is the second whale that has come ashore here in the, in within two years. Um, and this one came ashore alive and died. Uh, and we think that the, the first one came ashore alive also based on the condition that it was in. So it's pretty amazing that uh, both of those animals did come in in pretty much the exact same spot within two years. After cutting through nearly a foot of blubber and chainsawing the ribs apart, the team digs in deep to locate their jackpot, the stomach. Look at the animal's stomach to see what sorts of, uh, what sorts of uh, food it's been eating. and. Uh, most of what we find in these animals are squid beaks and some giant squid beaks and lots of other, sometimes there's other junk like nets and pieces of uh, flotsam and buckets and stuff in it. So we found mostly fishing gear in the ones that we've done so far. Except for a plastic oil container, his stomach is relatively empty, suggesting that he beached himself due to an undetermined sickness. There is no morgue for remains weighing 28 tons. So what happens to the body once the work here on the scene is completed? We will let the, um, the animal break down naturally uh, on the beach. At Famine Point, this is Martine Blue for Here and Now.